problem number 1 subdivision c parunga interest deposits for a year so in the data ku nam enna pannom appadina graph ponno deposits kuduthirukanga deposit 1000 nam bodu simple interest 80 deposit 2000 nam bodu simple interest 160 deposit 3000 nam bodu simple interest 240 deposit 4000 simple interest 320 deposit 5000 simple interest 400 so if we use pani nam enna pannom appadina graph vandu draw pannom so adukapra and the questions ku la nam answer pannano so first nam enna pannirala appadina idu graph potirala adukaprama and the questions ku la nam answer pannikala so first vandu parunga deposits in rupees so idla deposits vandu rupees la irukku 1000 2000 3000 4000 5000 irukku so na inga deposit ta x axis la eduthukka poran simple interest ah na y axis la eduthukka poran so inga 1000 2000 3000 4000 5000 irukradala now, x axis la oru oru 2 cm na vandu 1000 appdin eduthukuren adhe maadhiri y axis la oru oru 1 cm ay nanu 40 40 ah eduthukuren 40 rupees next 40 80 plus 40 120 plus 40 160 na andha maari eduthukku poren okay ingala so adukku munadi naanga points ezhudirken 100 1000 comma 80 2000 comma 160 3000 comma 240 4000 comma 320 5000 comma 400 okay ingala so, now we will draw the x-axis. The x-axis is axis drop on it, the y-axis is drop on it. already points. The x-axis is the x-axis. The x-axis is rupees. y-axis is the x-axis. The x-axis 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 is now, the points are in the graph. So, we have to do the reference. But, we have to do the points. So, 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 first point: 1080. So, x axis is 1000. That is 80 number mark. So, this is 1080. So, this is 1080. Next, 2000, 160. So, x axis is 2000, y axis is 160. So, 2000, 160. 3000, 240. x axis is 3000, y axis is 240. So, 3000, 240. Next, 240. Next, 4000, 320. x axis is 4000, y axis is 320. So, 4000, 320. Add the one the paranga five thousand comma four hundred. X axis la five thousand, y axis la four hundred. So five thousand comma four hundred. So upon a la pint made a mark panta. So is on the pathing of dinner. Now later in circle panigra. So, the points are in a circle. Now, what do we do? The points are in a joint. So, we have to do the points. Now, we have to graph the graph. So, we have to draw the graph. So, now we will join the points and join the graph. So, now we will join the points and join the graph. So, now we will delete the points. So, now we will copy the points. So, we will delete the points. So, now 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 we will delete so, the graph is going to be the origin of the graph. So, the graph is going to be the graph. So, the graph is going to be the graph. So, the graph is going to be the origin of the graph. So, what do we do? We extend the origin of the graph. So, we extend the origin of the origin. So, we extend the origin of the origin. So, the graph is going to be the origin of the graph. So, the graph is going to be the origin of the graph. 
origin value of both. So, that's why we can answer the first question. First question is answer. Yes, the graph passes through the axis. Passes through the origin. The graph passes through the origin. So, now the first question is answer. Second question is use the graph. To find the interest on 2500 for a year. Use the graph to find the interest on 2500 for a year. So, 2500 rupees के ये वो लो interest है ना हम graph use पनी करने पड़ेगी ना use the graph अगर हम रोम रोम क्यों graph use पनी 2500 interest के ये वो लो ना हम करने पड़ेगी ना तो उन्हें graph ऐड देख लाना हम So, the graph is written. So, 2500 is the interest. So, 2500 is the interest. So, this is the interest. 2500 is the interest. This is the interest. We will draw a dotted line. So, vertical is the dotted line. So, where we meet the graph, we will draw a horizontal line. We will draw a line. We will draw a horizontal line. So, 2500 is the interest. So, 2500 is the interest. rupees 2500 அது வந்து பத்திங்கே அப்படினா, rupees 200, இது வந்து நாம் graphல இருந்தே கண்டு புடித்துவிட்டும். அடுத்தது, third subdivision பருங்க, to get an interest of 280 per year, how much money should be deposited? So, ஒரு வஷத்துக்கு 280 ரோ நமக்கு வந்து interest வார்ணும்னா, நாம் எவ்வளோ deposit பண்ணும் அப்படின் கேக்கிறாங்க, so, இது வந்து பத்திங்கே அப்படினா, graphல நாம் horizontal ஒரு line போன்னும் so இதலந்து நாம் என்ன பண்ணும் அப்படினா vertical நாம் line போன்னும் so போட்டும் அப்படினா நமக்கு எவ்வளோ amount நாம் deposit போன்னும் அப்படின் நமக்கு தெரியும் so இங்க வந்து பதிங்க அப்படினா 3500 நாம் deposit போன்னும் so question 3 வந்து பதிங்க அப்படினா The amount to be deposited to get an interest of rupees 280. So 280 interest करेगे देखना हमें ये वाला deposit पनों नोब दी ना rupees 3500. So ना हमें ग्राफ लंदन ना मेड तेरे को Okay, so the amount to be deposited to get an interest of rupees 280 equal to 3500. This is the third question or the answer. Okay, so this is the scale. So, scale is the same as the scale. So, scale. Scale is the same as the x-axis. Scale is the same as the x-axis. X-axis is 1 cm equal to Sorry, x axis is 1 cm equal to rupees 500 or 2 cm equal to rupees 1000. x axis is 2 cm equal to 1000. That is why y axis is 1 cm equal to y axis is 1 cm equal to rupees 40 rupees. So, rupees 40 is 1 cm equal to y axis scale. So next day, what we are going to do is we are going to deposit the x-axis in the x-axis. So x-axis is going to deposit the x-axis in the x-axis. That is the y-axis in the y-axis. So we are going to deposit the interest in the x-axis. So we are going to deposit the interest in the x-axis. This is the y-axis. So we are going to deposit the interest in the x-axis. So we are going to deposit the x-axis. Okay, so now we are going to complete the graph. So, we are going to write the points. So, first point is 1000,80. So, 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 1000,80
80 second point வந்து பாத்தீங்க அப்படினா 2000 comma 160 so 2000 comma 160 third point வந்து பாத்தீங்க அப்படினா 3000 comma 240 so இது வந்து 3000 comma 240 அடுத்து வந்து பாத்தீங்க அப்படினா 4000 comma 320 4000 comma 320 அடுத்து வந்து பாத்தீங்க அப்படினா 5000 comma 400 5000 comma 400 so, this is the complete graph. Okay, we will see the problem. Complete graph. Okay, thank you, students.